fans, welcome back to Ballin' with Brett. I'm Brett, your host, and today we're going to go into the life of head coach Don Staley and talk to her, ask her a couple questions a little bit. So uh, come on, check it out. So Coach Staley, what is your um, daily routine like, during season? My daily routine, I, I usually get in the office, you know, right before 10. Um, 10 o'clock is our normal time when we uh, meet with the coaches and we talk about, a, you know, various things. You know, practice is one. Um, we'll, we'll hit on some type of recruiting. Um, and if there's a, a, a monthly uh, compliance meeting, we usually do it during that time. So it, it's more meeting in the mornings and then, you know, prep for uh, practice. Was it a dream of yours to become a coach? No, no, not at all. It's something that I never really thought um, would become my profession. And it's something that I never thought I could I could love. What do you want us as players to learn from you? Um, it's probably um, learning life lessons through basketball, much like I grew up. Uh, one that, you know, you're, you're able to work with different people. Um, like when you put a team together, you know, you come from different um, regions of the country, uh, but yet, you know, we somehow function as a team. And I want them to find whatever their niche is in life. Who puts your outfits together? Or when you wake up in the morning, do you have like a specific routine or a ritual? Um, uh, I usually try to get my hair done on game day. And then I'll go home and try to find an outfit. I'll, I'll give you a secret. Anytime that I wear like all black, can you put it together? I have, I have nothing else to wear. I couldn't figure out what to wear. So anytime I wear all black, um, that's kind of my easy outfit. Going back to playing, like when you're in the Olympics, like was that holding the torch or playing in the Olympics a part of your bucket list? I guess participating in the Olympics was probably, you know, the the thing that I wanted more than anything because I I feel like playing at the playing in the Olympics is the pinnacle of you know of somebody's sport. Traveling with teams and stuff, I know you have like a ton of teammates. Who was the who was the funniest? If I don't mention Coach McCray's name, she might get mad at me. So Nikki was <laughs> pretty <laughs> one of the funniest ones. Um, probably Carla McGee, who, who also coached with me here at South Carolina. And I would have to give it up for uh, Delisha Milton. We used to play this game called Make, make Me Laugh. And whoever started the game had to make us laugh. And, and if we didn't laugh, they have to continue to go through skit, different skits to figure out a way to make us laugh, and the, and the first person that laughs became the person who had to make other people laugh. Um, Coach McCray was real good at it, though. I mean, she's got some real good characters that, that you know, that still stick today. Our bus rides were great, you know. I was one that never slept on the bus, so I would try to keep other people up, and if they tried, like, you know, Delisha or Coach McCray tried to go to sleep, you know, I would I would mess with them. I would actually scream or I would kind of stick my finger in their ear or, or something like that to keep them up. And, you know, they would usually end up laughing and staying up with me. So mission accomplished. There you have it, fans. Thanks for checking out Ball and Brett episode with Coach Don Staley. Go Cox.